everybody. Okay, we'll do a review from yesterday. Yesterday I had a couple different T accounts that we introduced you to. You guys want to tell me what we talked about? Sales is good. Sales is what type of an account? Ooh, wrong. It is not an asset account. It's a revenue account, which goes under what name? Right. It's an owner's equity revenue account. Okay. What is sales is normal balance. Credit. We always, always, always credit sales. You will never see sales being debited because we live in the perfect world in this accounting class that nothing gets returned. Okay. We sell things, nobody brings anything back. That's when you get debit sales on return. We don't do returns. Just think of our business as a shop that says, I gave you a massage, you can't come back later and ask for your money back because we're a service business. Okay? And later on in the textbook, when we become a merchandising business, we have no refunds or exchanges. Okay? That's the type of business this is in accounting. What's another T account that I introduced you to? Very good. And what is utilities? An expense. Very good. So I always want to see expense at the end of all expense accounts. What happens to expense accounts? What side do they get messed with? Debit or credit? No. Expenses are always debited. You're going to need to know that for your cheat sheet test because that's their normal side. That's also their increase side. Again, a utility expense is an owner's equity expense account. Okay, its normal side or increase side is the debit. And when we're dealing with expenses, they're always going to continue to happen in the business. Now that doesn't mean that this month our phone bill was $50, next month it's going to be $40. Yeah, that looked like it went down, but don't we continue to have that expense? So it continues to add to our expense account. Okay? We're always going to have an electric bill. We're always going to have a water bill, possibly. We're always going to have a telephone bill. We're always going to have an internet bill. Whatever it may be, those are utilities, and that's going to keep increasing. Okay? Anything else that we introduced you to? Is that good? Two main ones right there. I have one more that we didn't, we did talk about, but you may have forgotten. AR. AR. And then you always put the customer's name at the end. Okay, AR account. What type of account is an AR account? Assets. What's its normal balance side? Debit. Debit. That's correct. Okay, these are customers. Remember, in these transactions, whether we're dealing with customers, vendors, expenses, capital, drawing, we talked about drawing too yesterday. You're always in the perspective of the owner of the business. Don't read, don't say I'm the business owner here and now I'm the customer over here. Don't do that because you'll mess up on your debits and credits. Then yesterday we also talked about drawing. Draw, comma, owner's name. Okay? It's an owner's equity account. It's one of the four children. It's the drawing. What do we do with drawing? Debit or credit normally? Debit, that's right, it's its normal balance. It increases on the debit side, decreases on credit. You'll never see drawing ever credited. Capital gets credited, drawing gets debited. The C, the D. If anything on the cheat sheet test, you should not miss that one. Okay? Okay, let's do a sample transaction and then we'll go into today's lesson. Okay, a transaction that we looked at yesterday was paid cash. A telephone bill, $250. What are my two T's? Cash and utilities what? Utilities expense. Cash. It's going to go down, so what side? Credit. Credit, 250 And what do I always do with expenses? Debited. Expenses are always debited. And now I have a debit and a credit. Okay? Let's do another one. This 
is for our two Lindsay's that are gone. Say hi, Lindsay. Hi, hi, hi Lindsay. Lindsay. Okay, next one. Uh, Jane Doe Company um, pays on accounts $500. Jane Doe Company pays on accounts. Who is Jane Doe Company? AR. AR, very good. AR She's a Doe. customer because customers will pay us money. So we'll do AR Doe. What are we getting from AR Doe Company? What are we getting from her? Somebody said it. Cash. Very good. Is cash going up? What side do we put the cash on? Very good. Debits. Okay. What's going on with AR Doe? Is their bill increasing or is their bill decreasing? Good. It's decreasing, so we're going to put that 250 on the credit side. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay. Next one. Let's do one more. AR goes down, the bill's going down. They're not adding any more stuff to their bill. They're taking away from their bill. Owner withdraws $500 for personal use. Very good. So owner's name, comma drawing. What, what's he taking out of the business? Cash. What's going on with cash? Okay. Why is cash increasing if he I takes it up? Or decreasing? Okay. Debit or credit cash? Okay. How much? $500. Drawing is always what? Debited. Debited. $500. You got a debit and a credit. Any questions, you can call that for Okay. Okay, page 31 working together. Okay, on page 31, on the working together in that yellow box, they break down your assets, your liabilities, and your owner's equity. Let's do that. So we have assets equal liabilities plus owner's equity. And this is about as close to the balance sheet as I'm going to show for the chapter. I'll save it for the way you're really supposed to do it. I don't want to confuse you. Okay, what is the balance of the cash account? Box. What's the next balance they give you on the asset side? See um, where I'm at? Accounts reported kids time. That's accounts receivable. No, and I'm not on kids time. I'm on page 31. Pool. Pool company. Yes, working together, page 31. Accounts receivable pool. And how much is that? What's the next asset they give us?